Today, we have some exciting news for all you Samsung fans out there. Just a few days after leaked renders gave us a glimpse of the Galaxy S25 Ultra, new images of the base Galaxy S25 have surfaced, and they're giving us a pretty good idea of what Samsung's next flagship is going to look like. The leak comes from none other than Android headlines, and we're going to break down everything we've learned so far. At first glance, the Galaxy S25 looks quite similar to its predecessor, the Galaxy S24. The overall design hasn't changed much, but there are a few subtle differences that make this model stand out. One of the key updates is the addition of a textured ring around the three rear cameras. This design element was first introduced with the Galaxy Z Fold 6 earlier this year, and it seems Samsung is carrying it over to the Galaxy S25. While the rest of the design might not seem drastically different, it's clear that Samsung is sticking to the sleek and modern aesthetic that's been a hallmark of their flagship series. Now, when it comes to size, the Galaxy S25 is just slightly more compact than the Galaxy S24. It reportedly measures 146.9 millimeters tall, 70.4 millimeters wide, and is 7.2 millimeters thick. Compare that to the Galaxy S24, which measures 147 millimeters by 70.6 millimeters by 7.6 millimeters, and you'll notice that the S25 is marginally slimmer. But don't worry, this slimmed down design doesn't mean we'll be seeing a decrease in battery capacity. Samsung bumped up the battery capacity from 3,900 mAh in the Galaxy S23 to 4,000 mAh in the Galaxy S24. And guess what? The Galaxy S25 will have the same 4,000 mAh battery, despite being a bit slimmer. So you can expect the same level of endurance in terms of battery life, which is great news for users who want their phones to last all day without constantly worrying about charging. Of course, any improvements in battery life will likely come from software optimizations and more importantly, the chip that powers the phone. Speaking of chips, this is where things get interesting. Rumors are swirling about which chip Samsung will use in the Galaxy S25. For years, Samsung has split its flagship lineup between Exynos and Snapdragon chips, depending on the region. However, there's speculation that Samsung may ditch the Exynos 2500, the successor to the Galaxy S24's Exynos 2400, and go all in on the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4. Why the potential switch? Well, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 is expected to be a powerhouse, but it's also rumored to come with a higher price tag. Some fans of Samsung have always preferred Snapdragon over Exynos for better performance and efficiency, but given the costs associated with the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4, Samsung might be forced to increase the price of the Galaxy S25. There's no concrete evidence supporting either option yet, so we'll have to wait for an official announcement to find out whether the Galaxy S25 will stick with Inksynos or fully embrace Snapdragon. Now let's talk about the display. The leaked renders suggest that the bezels on the Galaxy S25 might appear thinner at first glance. However, upon closer inspection, it seems that the bezels haven't actually shrunk compared to the Galaxy S24. But honestly, that's not a bad thing. The Galaxy S24 already had pretty slim bezels, so there wasn't much room for improvement in that area anyway. What do you think about the new leaks? Are you excited for the Galaxy S25, or are you waiting to see what other surprises Samsung has in store for us? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on the latest tech news. Thanks for watching.